Welcome back, guys, to Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Well, last episode, after Barrett explained his past in the area, we made our way to the Gold Saucer, arriving at the theme park in a mid-spectacle, with Cloud forced into a 3D brawler battle against the muscular Dio. With Cloud and Barrett separating from the others who set out to have fun in the park, our duo headed to a haunted hotel to secure rooms for the night, requiring a little interjection by the fortune-telling Kate Sip as our soldier now rests. God, that should make that photo. They should make that be a jump scare, too. <laughs> this place is crazy. Let's go to the Tomri suite. Nothing can stand me. Wish to go down, I presume. Yes. I'm assuming that's the direction. But to be honest, I understand why you're speaking like it. Fourth floor. Oh, of course. Very well. Fourth floor it is. Goodness me! Oh. Reservation under the name Palmer. Director of Space and Aeronautics? <laughs> yes, of course. Uh, one moment, please. <laughs> it says here you canceled those rooms. What? No, we didn't. <laughs> While we did have you booked for the Tonberry and Elagor suites, Mr. Palmer sent word that they were no longer required. That's impossible. Is something wrong? We lost the rooms. What? Tell him who I am. I did. Oh. Well, no point dwelling on it. Now, where can a man get a drink around here? <laughs> Yoo-hoo, waitress. You have yourselves a ghoulish and morbid evening. Good evening yourself. They just made this whole segment. And the moment he just started it, they've obviously made it absolutely legendary from this point, and I'm like, I'm all for it. It's already had such a massive glow up, it's unreal. Seaside fleet trap. I'm gonna head out for a bit. Cool. But not for fun, just to take a walk. Hey, you've been acting pretty weird lately, Cloud. Rest up and shake it off. You hear me? Yeah, I hear you. Tombri humidifier is the weirdest thing I thought I'd see this week. <laughs> My wife would slaughter it just on the basis of it adding humidity. Oh, what the hell? It just goes retribution is a hand while going for the rooms. What the hell? It's like I'm trying to sleep. Retribution is at hand. Squirts a mist on your face. Hi. It's just a dead end, right? Oh, it's a lovely Tombri about to kill me. Nice. <laughs> no, what the hell? Stop adjusting the humidity levels. Are you? Oh, wait, you're sucking it. Wait. Where'd you suck it from? <laughs> Why is it even going on anymore? It's like potion over here. What is this? Squishy noises near the bed. 
Oh, you're moving around, are you? Well, that's nice. How, how are you supposed to relax? Honestly. It's going to be a jack-in-the-box, right? Yeah. <laughs> you can't fool me. I know what the theme is. I guess I'm going to get in this bed. What's wrong with the humidity levels in this area that you have to adjust? Well, just get inside that chair. It's fine. I guess I'm going to sleep because it's not going to let me leave, right? I've got to rest while I can. I think you should sleep with it in the bed, but I don't know how sharp it is. That's <laughs> just what the... More tired than I thought. Sorry, man. Feel like I failed you. Sorry, man. Feel like I failed you. I have a question. <laughs> when I'm... S is it because I'm sleeping that I'm seeing this? <laughs> well, I'm... Okay. I've come to look at me. I'm controlling Zach, but from Cloud's perspective. Huh. Never seen material like this before. Something about the color... Didn't peg you as a bookworm. So this is Zach looking at Eris' room. What is there for me to do? is interesting if I head back in am I back on the perspective duty yep that's from Cloud's perspective weird as hell this be anything to do in Elmira's room except for mess up her chairs up or down would you say Probably down, considering. Oh. Big differences. <laughs> Would you care to join us? Definitely. I'm starved. <laughs> You're supposed to say thank you. Yes, ma'am. No, you're supposed to say it now. Thank you. Hey, did someone come by the house last night? Oh, you must mean Biggs. 
He was just dropping off some food. Then what's with the sneaking around? You've seen those wanted posters all over town? Well, his face is on them. How do you know him? I'd rather let him explain. So long as Marlene's here, he'll come around again. He won't. Biggs isn't coming back. Tifa isn't coming back. Daddy isn't coming back. Nobody's coming back ever again. <laughs> Sure they will. And I know just how to prove it to you. I'll go and get Biggs. Right now. <gasps> Need it? Always do. Honest and true. But... <laughs> Let me guess. You don't like dumb rhymes. <laughs> no, I like rhymes. Sometimes. <laughs> Not bad, kid. Not bad, kid. <clears throat> I'm glad the Tombri's gone in charge mode and not stab me mode. <laughs> No, I didn't know it was you the first time. <laughs> Thought I'd come see how you were holding up. What? Nothing. Never mind. You're still under the weather, huh? No, I'm fine. Sleep helped. <laughs> so does that mean you'd be up for a little sightseeing with yours truly? Just so happens the Skywheel's running a special for couples. For couples? As in... I'll leave that up to your imagination. It's more fun that way. Alright, gold saucer points. Participate in the park's attractions to earn gold saucer points, GP, then exchange your GP for illustrious collector's items as well as other useful trinkets at kiosks located around the park. It's a date, Aerith. Let's go. Gonna go to the Wonderman Square. Go play some mini games. Going down? This time, probably. Going down to the lobby, sir? Yes, this time, yes. Correct. Chadley's found his way in. What are you doing here, Chadley? What the crap? Hello there, Cloud. It's not often I see you in the company of a single comrade. Oh, yes. I believe I understand the situation. Forgive me. I didn't mean to intrude. You're both overdue for a break. Enjoy yourselves tonight. Thanks, Chadley. <laughs> Something tells me I'm going to have the worst nightmares when I go. What else can we check out here? 
sixth sense. My god. This is a place for people <laughs> that believe they've got a power. <laughs> Alright, uh, off we go, Eric. Where's Kate? I need Kate. Well, hello. You're not Kate. Whatever it is you're off to today, allow me to be your guide. Your Moogle guide. Speak to the robotic guide, Moogle, to fast travel from one area of the park to another. Where would you like to go, Kubo? I wonder if I want to go on foot to places, Kubo, on the basis of exploration. We look forward to serving you again soon, Kubo. So we have guided Google Tour fast travel. Maybe I want to get my bearings, the lay of the land and all that. Of course, they are just separated by these kind of walkways. I can't run on them, that's for certain. I don't know! Oh my god! Like when you're on holiday, when you're out somewhere, where the hell do you go first? Well, I think I should go over here first. Tricks. No, I want to talk to you. Can we just spend the day with you? Let's go to the event square. Oh, I actually did have to travel normally. I don't know. Cactor King, the clash with Kid Goblin? Are we? So this is a kid's show, is it? Tell me more. All of a sudden, he was surrounded by colorful cactuars. Kinji grinned menacingly, clutching his glove. Clang! rang the gong. The cactuar sprang into action, but Kinji was even faster. Jab, jab, strike! With his every punch, he scored knockout after knockout. Ding, ding, ding! No problem. Well, I'm sure that will have no bearing on anything. What a beauty show to watch. Anyway, uh, why do I like Kay so much? It is purely the voice acting is brilliant. Good day, and well met, most esteemed guest. Perchance you have points for me? So, as we explore this place, let's see what we can actually trade for. Oh, a loveless poster. Oh, we definitely need that. Stuffed Fat Chocobo, Giga Potion, Telurk Scripts Volume 3 I'd quite like, and Card 139 is Loveless. <laughs> Why is Loveless a card? I shall eagerly await our next interaction. I'm sure you will. Wow, 
Talk about beautiful. Do you know her? I do. That's Jessie. She died fighting for Avalanche. You know she was an actress? Yeah. She was a good friend. Not that I deserved one. Just a friend? Or a girlfriend? You can be pretty dense when it comes to that kind of stuff. She gave as good as she got. Never cut me any slack. And yeah, just a friend. Sure was that black and white? I don't follow. You, young man, still have a lot to learn. Right? I mean, it wasn't that black and white, but the pizza I probably own is like red and yellow. Pepperoni, yeah? Well, shall we? Yeah. So, where to next? The races, maybe? Not again. Guess they're done for the day, huh? Bummer. Just think, your friend used to perform on this very stage. Yeah. Would have been fun to see. What up? Explore other squares. There's a material down here. HP up material freestyle already. Okay. What is that mocking? Too bad Jesse didn't have that. <laughs> Would have survived. What message are you trying to send with that? What message are you trying to give me? Well, let's check out another section. Pretty big. No points to earn there. So where next? Feels weird to be walking at that speed. Everything else is up above me at this point. Skywheel Square. The speed square is that way. Is Sam blind to what were you saying? What have I missed? <laughs> now you're going to make me go back. Why? Why do you do this? <laughs> oh, walk back then. Uh. Supposedly, I missed something. I have no clue what I missed. <laughs> Marcus or anything. I'm so confused of what I missed. I must have missed it too because I don't know. What him? What? It's just him. <laughs> well, look who it is. We meet again. I must say your duel with Dio earlier was a sight to behold. <laughs> Gave me goosebumps. The stage calls to you, begs for you to bear your soul upon it. What are you doing out here? The park director requires my talents for a show. Huh. My fancy footwork, to be precise. What do you say? Shall we cut a rug? No. Not even the limelight can melt that icy heart. <laughs> Don't let me keep you two from all the fun. Go on, please. Experience all the saucer has to offer. 
So I didn't miss much. I missed a guy that I knew was actually already here. <laughs> Who had his back to us, which would probably be easily missable by most people. Uh, let's go to the Wonderment Square. I think that was where I was heading next. Oh, you really can't go there now. I have to walk there. Boo. Yes, it's not exactly that hard to miss someone who's got their back directly to you while you're walking through a corridor that you walked through before and didn't see him, or they weren't necessarily there at the time. I wouldn't say that's necessarily me being blind. <laughs> More just, uh, again, I don't walk up to people in the street, stick my head in their face if they got their back to me and go, Are you someone I know? <laughs> Are you? Let me avoid. Let me invade your personal space. <laughs> He says playing a video game, which is all about that, to be honest, to be fair. Welcome to Wonderman Square, Kubo. Oh, looks like this is your first time here. It's a lot easier to see K, isn't it? <laughs> I'm talking about the design that just pops. Let the art show begin. Try and see if you can guess what I'm painting. What are you painting? What are you painting on? Huh? Oh, okay. I think I can guess. Propaganda machine up here. how it stacks up against the real thing oh no <laughs> mini games how long are we gonna spend here how many tries i'm gonna have to take to win I'm dying to see the rest of the park. that's the real question right 3d brawler and queen's blood is going on over there as well this is the one that's on the mission thing should we do the one we did last so we can figure out like we should know roughly the controls right 3D Brawler, take on a variety of polygonal pugilists in 3D Brawler to earn prizes and gold source of points GP. Right hook, low left, and limit break both. Take note of your opponent's special skills on the Brawler selection screen. This will reveal what maneuvers they typically employ and how to defend against them. Alright, let's take on the Brawler. So he hooks, basically. Saucer Brawler, there's three fighters to fight. Can I win? Oh, which one's punch again? Oh, I blocked it. Come on then. Punch. <laughs> Dodge is better than a block then. <laughs> Too slow. <Same> whenever. <laughs> so I guess it's whoever reaches their limit break first wins, yeah? Come on, Ready whenever. I'm ending this. One down. Bring on the next opponent. Got a mega potion for that. <laughs> Fat Moogle. That's just me. Looks the normal size of one, according to what Kate's on. The Colossal Cuddler. <laughs> So I have straights, and for straights I have to point towards? A wind-up spell's treble, dodge the straight. So 
So whichever arm it is. I blocked it at least. Oh, that's your arm down? Oh, your arm is down on the left. I got that wrong. Ow. That's your arm down on the right. Okay. Just blocking, to be honest. I'm not dodging. There we go. I don't know if that was a hook or straight or what. That's left side. <laughs> That was a straight, not a hook. I wonder if I could just punch after. The moment I'm spending... No, that wasn't right! God, your polygon body shape makes it very hard for me. Uh, this is right. <laughs> Dodge two in a row. Wait, that's down? It didn't do the blue thing. Nice. A dry ether. Now we're up against Dio, the Beefcake Park Director. This is already three star though, so I'm assuming more will be unlocked for me winning this. Silver Brawler's Gloves, 200 gold source points. Oh, this guy has uppercuts on the left. Dodges free hit combos, leaving vulnerable to a crippling counter strike. So it's left and down, but this one's right and up. So I'm guessing if he winds up on the left, it's an uppercut. That's, yeah, maybe not first try. Maybe not. Ah! And you dodge that one. That's the uppercut look. Ah! Well, I dodged three in a row. Is it left? <laughs> I think it's left. <laughs> oh, that was a uh, that was an uppercut. Sorry. That's a hook. Oh. Damn it. Which is this one? That's right, okay. Left. <laughs> I pressed it! Well, there's an uppercut there, and I was thankful to be correct. That was towards... No! He's gonna win! That was a back... Oh. Trying to figure out the difference between the hook and the... Like, it would be a bit more of a telegram. But that's the whole point. It's not giving me that. Sloppy. That was sloppy. Yeah. Wait. <laughs> well. Come on, give me an opening at least. You get yeah. what the hell, man? You've got to hit me six times in a row. Yeah. You know, you give me opening. What the seven times? Oh, Can right. I have a strike, please? Yeah. Yeah, this is total dominion this time. My turn to fight. 
Oh, well, it took about seven tries. But it got there in the end. We have a flawless victory in the end. If you don't count all the other times I got hit in the face. All right, there's no more. We won! There's a crown. Oh, what? There's, is there a perfect crown as well? <laughs> if I perfect everyone, do I get, like, more points? I perfected him. Free challenge reward as well. Will you hear that? <laughs> Look at that now.